I didn't know where the fuck that was gonna end up. Oh shit! Oh, there's more than one! <laughs> Fuck! Step liquid nitrogen showers and it's like, yeah, but don't use it because you'll go blind. Uh, very, very bad people. I think we'll leave it at that. Oh, fuck! Fuck that noise, man. That was stupid as shit. Excuse me. Thank you, tree. Oh, there it is. Funk. Why do I do things and don't think about the consequences? Ancient book. I stumbled upon a cryptic old book in a mine chamber. Hints at the existence of concealed chambers that have never been sealed by any human before. Or seen, sorry. This revelation further complicates my effort to look at my daughter and ensure her safety. I read this book. It might hold the answers I so desperately seek. John Wilson. <laughs> Fuck, dude, this game. Seriously. This is great now, but when it's in your face, it's overwhelming. When it comes from behind, that's a bit more fun. Oh my god. Oh, all alternate yeah. Required. Just so I could find a fuse. <laughs> hey, buddy. Oi. Hey, prick. <laughs> Jesus fuck. Oh my. No. Okay, I'll just keep it off then. Alright, so there's the collapsed tunnels we have to go here. This will bring us all the way around for a little one person or maybe two person elevator compared to the big oh, Jesus fucking Christ. Holy shit, dude. I didn't anticipate to have any jump scares on the way. I'm close, but I'm not dead yet. This fucking elevator is the worst thing ever invented. chairs here I think oh and the window just opened I heard that noise and I was like that's oh we'll just do that I was wrong about the chairs but I'm gonna be right about the window <laughs> fucking cock stain it triggers it so you want to stay quiet <laughs> oh does it really oh my God. yeah Yeah, we need three hundred and forty more dollars. Nobody else died because we don't want to lose money. <laughs> oh my god! And, yep. I will. Sir, real welcoming. Uh 
Uh, is that someone? Wa oh, shit. I'm like, I don't even see anybody. <laughs> Fucking hell. Doesn't look good. Oh, what the fuck is that? Holy fuck! Dude! Absolutely fucking not on my life! No! Fuck that. So that's good. Back that way to the right. Ooh. It didn't make the hot. I think he's going the wrong way. I'm gonna go see if I can get Knox. Wide enough, might be able to pull this off and get him back. What the fuck was that? I think this one's a goodie. Negative six, okay. Working our way back up. Oh shit! Oh. That was a giant head on spider legs. That's not what I wanted to see today. Not even in the slightest. Kitty. But I saw a kitty today instead. Really? Hey, what's up? I ordered one flash and one walkie. Okay. Nice. I don't need a walkie, so... I mean, a flashlight, so I'm good. Like that, come check me out. Good promo. Don't check out... A bigger gamer. Oh, I appreciate that. I appreciate that. And... Don't check out Codename Power, though. He's a bully. Right, Jam? What? What was that? <laughs> I'm just, yeah, I'm just talking bitch. shit. <laughs> <laughs> you fuck. Oh, my Never God. Never forget. <laughs> That's wrong with the weird dude in it. Fuck is this? What in the fuck? This is the source of the growling and look at the Oh god. I mean if that's what you really want, I'll get one set up somehow, somehow. I, I gotta hit you up on the good time and so much. You you've perfected this art. Of the countdown. Welcome in, everybody. Hope you're all doing uh, swell. Van, welcome in, my friend. How are you doing? Uh, saw a tweet of yours earlier today. It seems like you got some spicy voice acting role coming up. <clears throat> but I digress. Hope you're doing well. Super tired today. I actually am late because I passed the fuck out for like 45. No, looks like an hour. I was just like, I'm going to do a quick little cat nap and I'll wake up in time for stream. And I woke up and I was like, fuck. <laughs> just an audition? Oh, okay. How dare you? How dare I what? What's up, Chaos? Welcome in. 
you have a frog in your throat, Chugs? Nope. I don't think so. I'll have some, uh, air, though. Oh, how dare I fall asleep? Yeah, no, for real. <clears throat> oh, that's the thing about getting older and your depression getting worse as you get older. You go right back to napping like you're a toddler. <laughs> uh, anyways, that was a dark joke. Sorry to start it off. I was like, <laughs> 100% mood. <laughs> uh, anyways, uh, naps are bay. That's true. Uh, so this week we're back to uh, a three day week after the uh, four stream extravaganza last week. Um, so if you haven't taken a look yet, we're going to be playing uh, demos tonight. I specifically only named three of them, but it's totally, it's actually a total amount of five, but I figure I'm not going to get through all of them. So I picked three to start with. So previously we played the demo for Unfollow. They ended up putting out a second one. Uh, so we're going to be playing that one first since I already have some, um, I have some level of expectations in, in, hope behind it so we'll be doing that first and then there's uh jawbreaker is second and then finally tic tac 12 o'clock is the last one soma i am glad you bring up the spinning um so i unfortunately a have to fast until 8 a.m tomorrow which blows so all i can have is water that's it no beer no whiskey no hot sauce nothing i have to be completely cleared out to run to the, the doctors tomorrow. They want to steal a bunch of my blood. I played Jawbreaker before. Oh my god, Soma. <laughs> oh, Vincent Light Games are great. Nice. Well, then I'm excited. Um, yeah, we're doing that tonight. Wednesday, I... From what I've reviewed, I don't think we'll beat it in one sitting, but we will definitely be playing it uh, the following week after then, if we're going to finish it up. And that's Hollow Cocoon. <clears throat> um, that was gifted to me, again, by uh, I Love Soup. I don't know if Soup is here right now, but Soup is absolutely fucking legendary with the amount of games that uh, they come through with just keys. Like, oh, here, by the way, whoop, Frisbee's it to me. Uh... Yeah, that is the... Okay, sorry. So, yeah, tonight we're doing the demos. Wednesday, tomorrow night, at 10 p.m., we're doing the Hollow Cocoon. And then Thursday, so it's a three days in a row, uh, 9 p.m. is Resident Evil 4. And I had to move uh, Saturday uh, up to Wednesday because uh, it is going to be the WWE Royal Rumble pay-per-view. It's the only time I actually watch WWE still... And because I just love that match that only comes around once a year. Well, technically twice. There's one one for men, one for women. Um, so I will not be anywhere near uh, my piece. Well, I mean, I'll be near and I'll be just downstairs. But um, hopefully having some buddies come over, we'll watch it together and eat really, really bad food. I didn't go feed grandma, but wanted to stop it and say hi. Lots of love. Have a great stream while we'll be lurking. Thank you, Soma. Hope your grandma's doing well. Hope you're doing even better. And uh, yeah, take it easy. Thank you. Appreciate you. Um, oh. Yeah, so sorry. So it's clear. I was trying to thought. So on Thursday, the last stream, uh, regular time, 9 p.m., that's going to be Resident Evil 4. It might be the last time we play it because it'll be done. I don't know. It's going to be close, though. We might be able to pull it off. Uh, so we got a pretty pretty good week scheduled for this week. Um, I'm still going to try to see if I can snag a uh, backup VR battery for the headset so that we can finish up um, both of the plans I have for VR. One being um, finishing the Exorcism game from the Gray Sweatpants stream. And then the other one is uh, Organ Quarter. I got a key for from Key Mailer. Uh, this is a VR survival horror game. So uh, 
we'll pick that one up right at the end of the exorcist so hopefully i have a battery or two that work by then uh so um i don't have much any other news things are just chilling um I'm only really looking towards trying to schedule everything else out from our polls. Um, so, for instance, we have um, the Jackbox Party Community Night. Uh, we still have to have Die Trump Die, my dad, on stream. The Welcome to the Game 2 stream. The Ghost Pepper Challenge and Lefty Mode Clone Hero stream. Which, by the way, Nox set me up today with... Um, uh, what's the fucking other program that goes with it now a oh, score spy and what it does is it actually pulls in your uh score and it uploads it online to this leaderboard and it's pretty cool uh of course the first fucking one i play i fc it and get the first place score it was fucking outrageous um yeah so i have to schedule those out and then once we're done with Resident Evil 4, I want to move on to um, another series. Because I feel like we did all the Resident Evil games. I kind of disjointed. Um, but I was choosing between... I tried to decide if I want to do the Bioshock trilogy, both Alan Wakes, or uh, the first... I think it's four Silent Hills. Is The Room Part 4? I don't remember. But... It was that. Oh, and then, of course, Dead Space. We played the first one. I think we played two and three. Ooh, Bioshock. Yeah. Bioshock's actually the current um, front runner for that poll by one vote over Alan Wake. By the way, if you all don't know what the hell I'm talking about with any of these votes, um, and you have some room to join another one, check out the Discord server. Uh, this is where all of our polls end up, along with the question of the day bot. Uh, we'll do watch parties, whether that's movies or uh, wrestling. Um, and the uh, you know one thing that was was popping off the past few days is the uh, the art channel. Some really cool shit in here. All sorts of crazy stuff. But anyways, find the Pulse channel if you go in there, check it out, and uh, feel free to react to it in the way that which you want to vote. Uh, uh. But for now, I think I'm ready to just jump right in. And, ah, Jesus. All right, Tree, hi. Uh, it is not hot sauce time. Unfortunately, I can't do any tonight. I have to fast until tomorrow morning. Um, But I'll pick it up again tomorrow. Don't you worry. You got it, baby. <clears throat> okay. Let us play unfollow. Okay. So again, we have played the, a demo for this already. This is a whole different demo. I've only seen a couple of games come out recently where they have more than one demo. I think the last one was Mirror Forge. And that game, of course, ended up really good. Um, so I have very high hopes for Unfollow now. Unless, of course, this demo is absolute dog shit, which it's not. I've heard from a lot of people that this one is very good as well. So. I should have really read the fucking synopsis to you first. I'll do that. I'll do that. Let me get into the, let the game load, and then I'm going to... And if when you cast out your demons that you don't throw away the best of yourself... Oh, that's nice. Hey, it's Grace. Best in the world. Hey, CM Punk. Hey, Soup. What's <gasps> up, friend? Oh, my dear. What Anne. in the world? Hello. You're not happy. You're not perfect. But don't worry. Oh. I will fix everything soon. No, 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 no. You'll see. You'll be perfect. Uh oh. Oh, hey, Post Malone. Shh. Dear 
Zoop, I hope you're doing well. You don't Funny. have to speak. Everything will be all right. Here it is. Oh, God. Soon you will feel better. Wait for me here, Anne. Oh. I'll be back soon. What a fucking cock tease. Jesus Christ. How hard would I have shit and pissed myself? Monster. Mm-hmm. Uh. Ha 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 ha. There's a lot of... Hey, pig. There's a lot of writing. Daddy, that's not nice. You want a friend? Hope you are too. I'm doing great. Um, I'm start... Oh, wow. Is she really going to try to escape? Uh, we're gonna be playing one of the games you got me recently um, tomorrow. Call, uh, was it Hollow Cocoon? Medical records: Camila Hunter. Patient name: Camila Hunter. Date of birth: September third, two thousand one. Medical record number five four six nine. Conditions: aggressive behavior, anger management issues, high risk of harm. Diagnosis date: October twelfth, twenty nineteen. That's weird. That's the day I got married. <laughs> Current status: ongoing. The patient's behavior poses a significant risk both to herself and to others. It's crucial to closely monitor and address her behavior to ensure the safety and well-being of herself and those around her. Professional intervention and support are essential to mitigate the potential harm she may cause. Um, we have 25 followers, apparently, on uh, our phone here. Also, we looking forward to the stream. Nice. Yeah, I've heard pretty good things. Um... You've really outdone yourself, stuck in a trap like a rat. This is fucked. Are people watching me? Their cameras? Or am I like an IRL streamer? And that's what's happening here. Oh, we have Sharon Meyer, August 31st, 1999 is the birth date. Medical record number 2351. Condition, paranoia. Diagnos diagnosis date, April 1st, 2023. Current status ongoing. Notes, the patient believes she is being persecuted by a strange curse. Her boyfriend, Jason, brought her to seek help as her paranoia has become increasingly distressing. Furthermore, her sister, Jennifer, has mysteriously disappeared, and Sharon's condition appears to be related to this event. Well. <clears throat> Sylvia Adams, born November 5th, 1994, medical record number 2809. Condition, Generalized Anxiety Disorder, GAD. Uh, diagnosed on July 20th, 2015. Ongoing. Sylvia Adams has been diagnosed with GAD, a mental health condition characterized by excessive and uncontrollable worry about various aspects of life. Did I just unfollow you? Oops, my finger slipped. Uh-oh. Said the word. The patient's anxiety poses challenges in her personal and professional life and it is essential to provide her with the necessary support and treatment. A lot of stuff to read around. Ugh. All right, this is Luis Wirtz, Wirtz, June 15th, 1997, record number 3001, severe acrophobia. November 5th, 2021 was the diagnosis date ongoing. Notes, Luis Wirtz has been diagnosed with severe acrophobia, an anxiety disorder characterized by an intense and debilitating fear of heights, the abyss, or elevated places. His condition is of such severity that it profoundly impairs his daily life, rendering him unable to engage in ordinary activities or travel to locations involving heights, such as skyscrapers, bridges, or even elevated walkways. Suck getting around. Anything else in here? Did I read this one already? Oh, this is Anne. This is me. Okay. Anne Somnia. Born June 14th, 2003. Record number X317. Condition, self-acceptance issues, bulimia nervosa, social media dependency. Diagnosis date, April 8th, 2018. Ongoing. The patient is confronted with a challenging constellation of conditions, including a history of severe bullying during her adolescence. 
resulting in a profound impact on her self-esteem and self-worth. Ansomnia has received a diagnosis of bulimia nervosa. She manifests a pronounced dependency on social media platforms where she seeks validation and connection. However, this often leads to heightened feelings of isolation and anxiety. The game's going to be deep. Yawn, wake me up when this is over. Hey, indie maniac. Can't go back there, so I'm assuming I have to go through this door. Oh, wait, what's this? Anne, are you sure you are you sure you're that different from Camilla? Weird sentence I was gonna figure out. Two of you have at least one thing in common. What could it be? I mean, we're both in here. A red light for. Interesting. Oh, I forgot. Ryo Kawasaki, born uh, March fourteenth, two thousand. Record number 1088, condition, body dysmorphic disorder, diagnosed October 20th, 2018, ongoing. Come on, check out the code on your medical record. Calm down. No, it's Ryo Kawasaki has been diagnosed with BDD, struggles with severe dissatisfaction with his physical appearance and engages in extreme measures to alter it. He's undergone surgeries to remove his nipples and remove two ribs due to his distorted perception of his body. Additionally, he experiences significant distress related to perceived flaws in his facial features. Okay. So there's a code in my medical records? I didn't see it. Oh, yeah. It's X317, but it looks like it's 5317. That's what it appears. Oh, that works. Lies? Huh? Fuck's sakes. <sighs> to move faster, you mean sprint. Phone, nothing in my inventory. Documents, apparently nothing. I have 18 followers according to my phone. I don't know what that means or... Let's suck out the unwanted fat. Get your perfect body with our liposuction. <laughs> I love this aesthetic where it's like everything seems really foggy for some reason. Ah! Are you sure you're not adopted? Damn, a photo of my mother. What, Naomi Montgomery is really your mother? Yo, that I know that, wait, they keep using faces over here that I know, I just realized that. I saw uh, uh, IGP at some point. Remember the day my father took this photo? We're up to 21 now. 50. That's really cool that they added uh, content creators, apparently. Team that way. That's really fucking cool. Graffiti in scenario with mannequins, however, is not. Fucking awful. Laboratory. Cannot get into it. And dead end. Some practice running over. I interact with this. Oh. I can squeeze through. Music next door. Okay. Guess that's something. Oh, here. Your lost cause. Cancel Anne. Holy shit. I had a tough day today. I had a fight with mom again and it hurt. Why doesn't she ever seem to understand me? But then I met grandma and she took me to a secret magic world only we know. We talked about fairies, unicorns, and dragons. I felt so free and happy. It was like nothing else mattered. Like I could do anything with my imagination. How do I... Oh. I like to think that life is magical. Like there's always a secret door, someone ready to open up to a new and 
amazing world I can get away to. Hope one day mom understands this too and we can go to the beautiful magic world together. Tell that I'm thankful I have grandma by my side, ready to dream and fly high. Hmm. Magic edit to document. Okay. Means something. Means something to us, damn it. Something, mannequin. Uh, Ginger, thanks for the lurk, my guy. Hope you're doing well. Oh, look at them looking over, being fucking creepy. Rest augmentation. Dream big. Montgomery Clinic. Call now for a free consultation. I heard the noise before I saw the fucking wheelchair. Can't squeeze through here, can I? Nope. Okay. No. Which one of you did that? Not funny. There's nothing hanging around on the sides. I always like to look for the little things that normally people wouldn't look for. But I don't do it all the time. Once I get scared, then I that, that's it. Definitely creeped out, that's for sure. But I don't know if I'm scared yet. I don't know what that fucking why the light goes red. Does it mean? Is it like an attack thing or a defense thing? Oh, this is how I get around. Okay, I'm gonna have to go check the other door. Something back there I can. Okay, it's probably locked. Yep. Okay. That was great. I had a feeling it was locked the whole time. That's why I skipped it. God damn. Sometimes I should really listen to myself. Maybe I'd remember. I would swear I just saw something right behind you. What? Oh, you fucker! Dude! <laughs> no! That's some bullshit. <laughs> I'm like, stuck here. Also locked. What? Changed again? Doing. Why do you keep changing with that one door? Fucking weird. Oh. Metal key. Metal key with a snake shaped keychain. Oh. Very nice. Today's treatment. Perform surgery on the head and both arms. Oh. Eight. Oh, hi again. Oh! Oh my god! I didn't mean to die, but like I got trapped. Oh, that was fucking terrifying. It just moves. <laughs> I can't run around it. I can't run. Like, I get stuck in corners or something. Very confused. A 
Hello? Oh. Alright. Maybe that goes to that door. That is, so I can just run around. Then. Oh, okay, I see where I got caught on there. Like, how is this supposed to be helping? It's not... Uh... <coughs> Holy shit. <coughs> oh, I just came out of nowhere. All right, fuck it. Go for the door. Oh, fuck. You won't come into the light. Oh, let's see if this actually does anything. Sugar, allergic to the fuckery. Kazoo tights. Oh. Okay. So that does work. It just takes a long fucking time. Wicked Shard, welcome in. How are you, my friend? Sass, how are you? Something just loaded. <clears throat> I mean, because it's scary as fuck. Uh, that one wasn't moving. Like, it would, when you turned around, it would, like, have changed positions. You're like, oh, okay. And then I was approaching it after finding a key, and it was like, <laughs> not cool. I'm not gonna slide in that elevator. That's. Uh. But, mate. <laughs> Try to go in here, I guess. Bioshock traumatized me. We'll be playing Bioshock soon, actually. It seems. Denial. I can't read everything. Anna and Grace talking, apparently. Can I, like, interact with this at all? No. <clears throat> I can hardly read it. And I alone am to blame for all this happening. If they are targeting me, it's because I'm fat and ugly. Grace, absolutely not, Anne. You can't blame yourself or maybe the for their unwarranted hatred and if i were a pretty girl rest assured that no one would object i'm the one who has to change so i'll never be made fun of again grace oh and i learned to blame fat and ugly the one who has to change denial i see okay <clears throat> Night's going good so far. I started streaming a little bit late because I uh, decided to just take a nap at like 8.30, not like, probably like 7.30, 7.45 at night. Don't I had stream at 9. What is this, my inner monologue? <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> All right, dickhead. Oh, no, you got stabbed in the back while getting a sodi pop? Oh, can't take that out of your back. Oh, I would I would totally do that. It would probably make you feel better at this point. It's a black Music is so good. Fuck. <laughs> 
all of that noise, dude. Isn't that just fucking singing away like it's no big fucking deal? That door is locked. Hey, wait for me. <clears throat> right, can I get back into the offices? I can. All right, let's do a big sweep. Ah! My feed deserves better. Are you okay? Yeah, I, I hate that. It's a bummer that people have to worry about their, their self-image. Like, I mean, I know it all. But, like, I understand this is a drawing, but bait... Based on what I'm looking at, um, grade A, Lord of the Dark, added to documents. Very sad. <clears throat> Still have the time to listen to the radio. Okay. Fair enough, my friend. You know, try to find uh, ever loving uh, Sandstorm by Darude pop off in here back there for whatever reason all right so you found a piece of lore in that room so i guess that mattered i okay <laughs> what fuck noise was that <clears throat> Camila, la, you don't deserve him. Hey, Wendy Indy, he is cute. Hashtag now listening. In Ryan's CD, Josh got this for me. I never quite understood it. Listen to it. Did you really sit there and take it in? What's up, Fry? Welcome in. How you doing? It was a sad horror game. I think it it's gonna be relatively sad, yeah. Um, but so far it hasn't been anything super sad, like just depictions and stuff. Nothing played out. Oh God, this fucking thing again! Oh God. Jesus fucking Christ. The fuck you too. Giant mouthworm. Where the fuck you're supposed to be? Your eyes have been gouged out. It's a head run, Chucks. Ken, what's up? Oh shit. I didn't even hear the fucking raid come in. Hey, Ken. Welcome in, everybody. How you all doing? <laughs> Thanks, I hate it. <laughs> That's terrifying. <laughs> oh, jeez. Hello, Ken. How was your stream? Tell me all about it. I think... What did I see you play earlier? I can't remember now. One Arm Games. Thank you for the fall. Welcome to the mob. Raid, why do we have a, to join at that point? Uh, good timing. But yeah, welcome in, Lucky. How you doing? Call to the lamb. Yes. Just cozy times today. Nice. Thank you. I will happily hydrate. Perfect timing, I'd say. Yeah. Yep. <clears throat> it's great. <laughs> I like to have a dramatic entrance. What can I say? Yeah, you couldn't have timed it any better. That's for sure. I just realized I changed off of red in here because heavy was like like oh can you change it to something other than red i was like yeah and we did purple and he's like it looks really cool i was like yeah like really quick really quick serious serious conversation one moment indulge me do we like this color because i'm more than happy with keeping it i i feel like maybe there was too much red on this entire screen Maybe this is, uh, 
Maybe this is a game changer. Purple is cool. Purple fits it actually much better. Yeah, I love this purple. Like that color. All right. I guess that's that then. And it feels brighter in here too, but not to the point where it's hurting my fucking eyes. Like, you know, like fluorescent light bulbs in office spaces where you're just like, it's dr your eyes just dry out of your head all day. Yeah. Not there. So that's good. Well, good. All right. All right. Enough of that. Enough of that. Thank you. Back, back to what we're doing. Uh, anywho. Yes. So for all of you that came over in the raid, thank you so much. Uh, I, I'm sure you had a great time hanging with Ken and Cole to the Lamb too. I haven't ever played it, but I know I watched a lot of gameplay of it for a multitude of different streamers. It looks like a good game. Um, <clears throat> but uh, yeah, so you don't know who I am. Uh, I'm the Juggernaut. You can call me Jug, Jugs, Juggy, Juggies. What, any other type of mixture you can think of, that's completely fine with me. Uh, I am a 99% horror streamer. Um, that 1% is for random shit here and there, usually like a clone hero, or we have like a community night party where we'll do like, you know, Among Us or Jackbox party, those types of things. Um, yeah, I'm part of the CEOs of Screams as well as Channel 13 Horror. Uh, if you haven't checked out either of those before, uh, welcome you to do so. There's some links there in chat you can use for your liking. Juggernaughty, oh God. I like to set my bedroom lights to purple at night because it is relaxing, yeah. I feel that. I feel like we could see more definition. The red kind of watched things into the background. Yeah, true. And I could see it better. All right. Yeah, and I agree. Now you can actually see like details of things in the room. And especially Norman. He's just chilling, peeking his head over channel 13. Actually, maybe we'll uh, get more front and center. Yeah. That looks better. <laughs> now you can see him. Norman is cool. Norman's the fucking shit. If you haven't played My Friendly Neighborhood, do it. Spicy Drunken Brain. Mmm. Thanks, <laughs> thanks, Sean. I've seen this cooking channel. Excited to try this. Okay. So I need half a brain. Yeah, don't we all? 750 milliliters of red wine. Nice. And a handful of red chili peppers. That sounds fantastic. Preheat the oven to 180 degrees Celsius or 350 Fahrenheit. Thoroughly wash the brain. Place the brain, chili peppers, and red wine in the oven. Bake the brain until the meat is tender and well cooked. Serve the brain with red wine and hot chili peppers and enjoy it with its succulent sauce. And a tip from John's Kitchen. Adjust the amount of chili peppers to your personal taste. This is going to be good for a 15-minute recipe, three to five people, and it's very easy. That's what you want to eat? All right. Red wine and hot peppers? Hell yeah. <laughs> Delicious. All right. Let's go. Oh, like that before. Let's go find us a fucking brain, some wine, and chili peppers. What the fuck was that? Wait a minute. That shadow looks familiar. Yeah, who the fuck was that? I could hardly see over the fucking light. Hello? This is all open now. Oh, God. What happened here? <laughs> Damn. This looks like a giant fucking, like, Kraken thing. Like, this, like that's like the head. And it has all the tentacles and arms and shit. Fuck. What the fuck? These things aren't gonna attack me, are they? Yeah, I don't I don't mean any harm or anything to any of you, uh big old tentacle uh worm things. I don't know what I don't know what you uh species you are or what I'm supposed to call you but looks like you're busy looking around that's that's fine I'm uh, I'm just looking around too yeah fry there it is uh sorry if I step on one of your tails I'm, I'm trying not to I don't know if these are tails actually or just smaller arms okay all right well I'm gonna go back over here now uh excuse me Thank you. 
Oh. <clears throat> I lost 10 pounds. Fuck. Unfollowed. You're just not that entertaining. Bye. Wow, Leo. And you don't need to do this. We are here for you. Thanks, Shep. I lost 10 pounds. Shit, I wish I could. Finally, I can't believe I made it through the summer. It was really hard. I dreamed about food. But now no one will ever call me fat or pig again. Everyone will see how thin I am. It's... It will be F-A-B-U-L-O-U-S to go back to school. Even mom and dad were surprised. They didn't believe I could do it. They never believed in me. I'm so confident now. I could cry. Get it, girl. What do you think of Resident Evil 4? And would you play OG? Um, I didn't finish it yet. Um, I think I'm going to end up finishing it on Thursday. Maybe. But I've been liking it so far. And would I ever play OG? I mean, maybe. Maybe someday. This is mega depressing. Yeah, you can tell, like, the shit she had to go through. It super sucks. Alright, well, I found the fucking... That's not a brain, but it looks good. I don't have all the ingredients yet. Alright, I just have to get everything at once. Oh, good. Chili pepper. 54 kilocalories. An intense, vibrant red chili pepper. Spicy to the touch. All right, I crave spicy food. Hear that? All right, so we gotta find a brain and uh, wine. This is like going to high school in the early two thousands when you couldn't be thin or tan enough. Fuck's sake! Yeah, for real. Ooh, we got some wine. Red wine, six hundred thirty-four kilocalories. A bottle of red wine. The label promises an intoxicating taste. Nice. Top notch wine from Cantina Romanese, right? Hey, Nut Pinto. That's your real name. All right, so where the fuck am I going to find a brain? If I only had a brain. Yeah, I do them all in one shot. That's what I figured. Oh, God! Jesus fucking Christ! Wow. Oh, my fucking head hurts from that. Why are you laughing? That was fucking scary. You guys are me. <laughs> you tried to be different, to be creative, to be yourself. <laughs> no. Everyone you know is making fun of you. No one cares about you, and no one will if you keep this up. Beauty is the only thing that matters in this world. Why did you choose to neglect it with your quirks? But don't worry. Now it's time. With a little intervention, I'll restore order. Help. Somebody? Oh, Anne, you'll understand how important it is to be obedient. Oh, yes, you will. Beauty is a gift, and obedience is the way to preserve it. No! Your eccentricity has transformed. <laughs> but I, I, with my touch, I'll bestow your beauty. Yeah, I see you've done a great job on yourself so far. <laughs> Gross. <laughs> so like is it? Oh. Okay, Carmilla, darling, take this thing and make sure it gets a proper cleaning. What did you take from me? My eye or something? <sighs> Whale? Oh. Uh, my head. That hurt. What? What was that? Yeah, what happened? Did I... Did I faint? Can you faint in a nightmare? It was a nightmare? But is this really... Unfollowed. Life's too short for this nonsense. Alright, bye. 
I have to get out of here. Because clearly your mama knows best, right? Find what has been taken away from you. Well, they didn't take the peppers or the wine. Maybe they took half of my brain. Jesus, that was fucked up. What a cringeworthy narcissist. You are beautiful. You'll never, ever pull off that look, trust me. All right, Camilla. Fucking bitch. Ah. I saw you fucking move down there. You rotated. Sketchy ass motherfucker. All right, yeah, this is this hallway again. Fucker. <laughs> Oh, there's more than one. Fuck. I'm so fucked. Oh. How many times do I hit him with this fucking thing? Is what is hitting me? Oh, there's a third one. Mother well, told me to wash that thing in the laundry. Why won't you die? Oh, fuck. Okay, that worked. Woo! Surprise. <laughs> All right, good. Well, I'm glad that's over with. I knew something was up and that one fucking rotated. Psycho babble bullshit. God damn. This is shit mannequins. All right. Well, they said something about the laundry. There's something over here. How do I, uh... Oh. Is that yours? Anne's brain. Touched it with bare hands. Anne's brain, 760 kilocals. Human brain still pulsating and unsettling. Behold what folks dub brainwash. Oh my god. <laughs> well, good. I can go, uh... Use my brain to make this thing to feed to the... <gasps> Fucking... Holy fuck, dude. Why is that a thing? Right. Sorry, I got like angry at it. <laughs> Fuck. Like, is there an easier way to kill this fucking thing? It has to be, right?
You have to go up to the limbs, I think. The jump scares are great. Yeah, they're very well timed. <laughs> Yo, what's up, Max? Welcome in, my guy. How you doing? Hope you're having a splendid evening. I go back through here. We go talk to the giant headworm. Whatever the fuck this thing's called. Oh, wait. No, I haven't cooked it yet. What am I talking about? How do I get to the kitchen again? Bro, wasn't the kitchen behind him? Or was it this? He was over to the right. <laughs> yeah, I think it was in here. I'm scared it was fun to come into. Yeah, I've had a couple of good ones. Yeah, I got jumped out of my fucking skin right here. I was leaving and someone came from the right side of the screen and came and like jumped over to the left in front of me and grabbed me. Demon, what's up, my dude? Welcome in. Hope you're doing well tonight. All right, we've got the brain in. Put the wine in. Okay, wine first. Then the brain. No, the peppers. And then, oh, we haven't cleaned the brain yet. We got to clean it. Wash it. Be sanitary with it, I guess. But I couldn't just use it in the sink. It wouldn't let me. What about over here? There's a sink over here? No. Where the wine was. Uh. Oh, that's fun. We're just enjoying making Pokemon into slaves. Oh, pal. Girl. Lovely. Do I put it down somewhere to chop it? Over here. Oh. The only one's half the brain, right? Yeah, throw it in the trash. That's a good spot for it. Oh no, it just worked. Okay. Bone appetit. Bone apple tit. Not impressed. Oh, it's already cut. 1440 kill count. It's almost like a whole day's <laughs> basal metabolism. Spicy drug drinking brain, 1,448 kilocals. A brain cooked to perfection in the oven, emitting a tantalizing aroma. Hmm. That sounded like a mannequin. I don't see one. Ugh. Jesus fucking Christ, leave me alone, I mother! You not to move. Is it possible that even something as simple as this doesn't get through that stupid? Why do you keep of having to scare me? Ah. Uh. Thank you, Cynthia. I thought she was getting eaten. It's the opposite of that. Defeat your mother. You, stupid whale. Hey! <laughs> oh God, what is that? Oh my god, oh, there's so many of them! Leave me alone! God damn, my mother's an asshole in this game, apparently. This one. Whoa! Woo! 
Fucker suck. Oh, ho, ho, ho. and weaved yeah thud that's a big one I got her I think I had to keep attack her to release the butterflies I see now. Okay. She has little yellow spots on her that appear every once in a bit. These little shadow creatures are fucking creepy. So I'm gonna follow, don't mind if I do, although my name wouldn't allow it. Hey! What up one time? What in the Vada Kedavra is going on here? <laughs> What's up, demonic? I got her. Anne, 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 wait. Be reasonable. Excu I'm excuse your me. Mother. I'm doing all of this How's the game? This is a really good demo. You. It's a lot longer than I thought, too. You can't really think of leaving me like this. Come on, Anne. Let's try to start over. Accept yourself and forgive Mom. Anne, what are you doing? Hey, it's as Asma. <laughs> I'm gonna get the couple of people over there. It's like, oh, I know that one. Looks like she's from Mortal Kombat. Can't sleep for that. Hold my beer. It's starting to get interesting. Uh, God of Haria. Uh, accept yourself or forgive mom. Move forward. Let's start, let's accept ourselves. That's that's the first step to, you know, taking care of yourself. Oh, wow, she did it. Yo, Carlton. <laughs> Cursed, ungrateful brat! You'll pay for this! I swear you'll pay! My man's hungry! <laughs> hey, Messi! Your new mother's kinda. Yeah. <laughs> uh. Yeah, you want that? You want that brain? The drunken brain I made for you, my friend? Fucking spite, yeah, uh-huh. The whale has arrived. Hide the dirt, cannonball. You'll empty the pool. Wow. You are a big fat pig. The punch is ready to be with all that blubber. The crab is You are a big fat pig. Come on, show us how it's done. I may wanted to bite out of that ass. Want the attack on Titans? <laughs> we never gave him any of the... The drunken brain. I, did I thought all that, that everyone would have noticed course. my change when I went back to school with my new look. They'd been making fun of me for years. They'd make me feel like a freak. And after I starved myself for an entire summer, nobody even came to me to apologize or say something nice. Nothing. I'm not their freak show anymore. And now they don't see me. The whole but they won't ignore me forever. <laughs> I'm better than them. I'm special. They'll be forced to look at me. Chapter 2 Anger. I know it hurts to be someone mm. like you who's never known love or affection. To All right. come back to an empty house. Thank you for playing the Unfollow demo. Do you really care about the themes of this game? We are overwhelmed by your support. Unfollow keeps growing, and that's because of you. We'd like to express our gratitude to those who believe in the project from the beginning. If you want to support us, please add this game to wish list and spread the word to your friends. Get it, girl. 
Yeah, that's good. They're uh, two for two. Oh. They're two for two on their demos, that's for sure. Damn, I'm sad again. <laughs> All right. Let's get the next one ready to go. So, yeah, so that was uh, Unfollow. I'll actually, I forgot to read the fucking synopsis on that one. So, Unfollow, which is already on my, uh, it's already on my, my, uh, wish list. Uh, Unfollow is a surreal horror game where you play as a victim of bullying, fighting terrifying monsters as you uncover a dark mystery and a thrilling journey of terror. It pushes you to the edge of your seat as you explore the dark impact of social media on mental health. I enjoyed it. That was good. Yeah, the ending was different to the demo I played. Yeah, they did a second demo. Um, this one came out a couple months ago, but the first one came out like I think it was like a year and a half ago or something. It was a minute. Uh, so the next one we're going to do is Jawbreaker. So I'll read this one out. <clears throat> Uh, Jawbreaker, will you survive when the world falls apart? Jawbreaker is a survival horror game that will have you... Hello? Not to the network issue. Suck my ass on your network issue. There you go. Alright, all's well. Uh, let me try that again. Will you survive when... <clears throat> My connection is fine. I'm currently streaming title. Fucking with me. Oh, for fuck's sake. Yep, it's all fucked now. Damn it, title. <sighs> Absolutely ridiculous. Sorry, one second, everybody. I think it probably went through an update and it just hasn't had me do anything with it. <clears throat> will you survive when the world falls apart? Jawbreaker is a survival horror game that will have you running, hiding, and fighting in a terrifying gang-infested society on the verge of collapse. Though that's not all. Once the sun goes down, the true fear begins. And this is, uh, this one actually has a due date. Unfall just says coming soon. Oh, no, I'm sorry. It said 2024. This says March 2024. So this is about a month and a week out, maybe. That's Twitch and OBS. Well, it has nothing to do with Twitch and OBS. It was my music just stopping. Okay, cool. Let me load this up over here. Bye. Hello, friend. Welcome in. Ellen content must have some random script that runs at the very start. First time you play it. Dying Light without parkour. Uh, not too sure, but I'm intrigued. Just going through all the graphic settings right now. Motion blur disabled by default. Thank you. Love that. Um, I'm like stuck in a menu right now. Uh, I had to restart it. Something got fucky there. <laughs> so I'm late. Was video editing? How is everyone? Twi- Apologize for being late. You come in whenever you want. And, uh, I'm doing pretty good. Hope you're doing well. I just heard of gangs at night, worst time in city falling apart. Yeah. Yeah, yeah absolutely. All right, cool. Everything's back to normal there. Twy water. <laughs> do, do, do. Jawbreaker. Oh, 
Jawbreaker. Okay. Let me update the category to Jawbreaker. I don't think either of these selections are the correct jawbreaker. Yikes. I'll just click on that one, I guess, that has no image. <laughs> Hope we both are able to get rest soon. I also tied one time, I see. I keep doing water every time I see Twine until he says to stop. I get tired trying to deal with my PC. Yeah, it's it's a struggle, man, but you'll get there. It takes uh, takes a lot of trial and error and research and you start learning a lot about computers just by having one now let's go uh. <laughs> excuse me fuck oh get some water oh bless up thank you this one for jawbreaker showcases level of the break-in which is after the streets of New Citadel City before the main events of the story. So they must have some really long fucking, like, prologue that leads to the actual story of the game. Cool. <clears throat> okay. Woo! Excuse me. Hey, I just broke into the New Citadel police station. <sighs> Are you sure this place is abandoned? Hope so. According to the 48th Street Gang, it looks to be. We owe them half the supplies you find move? in the tip, by the way. <laughs> All right. Great shot, with milk curse, the place for anything Thank valuable. You. I didn't say it back at the bunker, but thanks for volunteering. Technically, it's my turn to look for supplies. But enough about that. I can't move. Stay safe. Oh, it just didn't want me to move. Loot the police station for any supplies. Okay. A map of the police <laughs> station. Mm, I won't be here long enough to need it. Sure. Be cool to like take a picture of it or something. I don't know what the fuck I'm even looking for. I to examine. Hate that. Inventory. Check your current tasks, items, map, and health in the inventory. Thanks, I guess. Vision pills, rare. In them. Six tablets. Dr. Dope's old-fashioned vision pills may cause bleeding from the eyes. Dr. Anthony B. Dope. <laughs> vision pills, one or two tablets, water before hours. Oops. Hey, Avery! I'm lurking, love you tons. Thank you, buddy. I'm gonna have to learn a lot more about how our PC works and runs. Yep, yeah, absolutely, dude. It's the way it's, it's the way it is. Guess you never text me or followed up at all. Give me if you want to play lonely. <laughs> <laughs> oh god, this calls for you, fucking Mark. That's so funny. Cool, dude. Uh, yo, I know Knox uh, is not streaming. I don't think he plays Pathfinder tonight. I know he played last night. Um, hit him up and ask him how to set up the, uh, the score spy that all of your, um, all of your scores, uh, end up on leaderboards. We could battle each other. Nothing in there that would... Well, that's not a good fire alarm. I mean, not that I anticipated to all of a sudden work based on where we are in this game. Well, here we go, something else. <clears throat> hiding stay unseen hiding cabinets under tables between shelves and in shadows to stay in one piece great that guy looks scary hate that you actually press the hide button there use locker all right so that's just uh to be able to open it and look inside versus hiding is an actual hide unsorted loot Let me examine it sort of loot still yeah okay take that so oh, good we found some loot in that binder let me see what this looks like 
Oh, it automates all of it. Okay, perfect. Love it. <clears throat> One piece, not ton of pieces. Huh. Yeah, so that's all automated. All I do is press a button. It just goes through the motions. That's easy enough. Okay, what else did we get around? Don't want to go anywhere near that metal detector. I feel like that's going to pose a problem. Oh, it's actually unlocked? I kind of expected that to be locked. Over here or there. I didn't realize I could look through fucking drawers. Ooh, found it. Do I have to crouch for this? Is that what you're telling me? Or do I fucking crouch? Hold on. Crouch. Control. That I fucking press control. Control. How about this control? No? This? Brother. Why is that not opening? Or, I mean, not open. Why can't I take it? Hello there. Foxy Angel, welcome in. How are you? Why can I not... Fucking... This, this really sucks. I wish I could fucking crouch. Oh shit, hit the wrong button. Now it suddenly works. I don't understand that at all. <laughs> okay, got more unsorted loot. That's good. Bam, bam, bam. Jammed. In there, can I look? Oh, of course, can I look through the office. The uh, now I can't. Okay, maybe I have to be moving to do it. Jammed. Jeez. My word. How do they get any work done in this police station? Oh, never mind. Uh, excuse me. All right. Uh, two out of four. This is only a demo. Yeah. Just got done torturing a member of my hive mind. He gave me a chaos mod to play with in Minecraft. That sounds like fun. Yeah, we're just doing a demo night tonight, demon. Um, we did unfollow. Now we're doing Jawbreaker. We still have uh, Tic Tac 12 o'clock or something. Office cabinet key. Oh. That seems to be something good that I just picked up. In there. Oh, sure. That's number three. I bet you the last piece back in here. And I think it was. This one? It was that one. Okay. Here we go. This should be enough to bring back to the bunker. Time to go. Yeah. Get the fuck out of here before someone else gets here. You know what I'm saying? Is 
7047. Hmm. Looks like a password. Could be valuable. Someone's setting us up. Where on earth did I punch that in? I didn't see any keypads anywhere. Computer? None of these computers are obviously going to be on. 7047. Go back down this way again. On the wall, no locked doors, no safes. Huh. Oh. I had to. The evidence room. Ah, that's more loot than I expected. Time to get out of here. Yeah, I'm starting to push my luck. Get the fuck out of here. Someone's right out there. That thing just fucking beat. This hide. I murdered him repeatedly in very creative ways. It was hilarious watching him scramble to try and survive whatever I threw at him. That's funny. I don't hear footsteps or anything. Hmm. Maybe I have to go through another door and I have to run back here or some shit. Fuck do I get out of here again? Oh, okay. I thought he pressed F. Alright, whatever. Or like, oh god, fuck. Locked up. The whole thing was a setup. I need to get out of the situation, make it back to the bunker. That sucks. All that loot. Damn it. Oh, they took everything. They got me to take all the risk and then they take off with all the loot. Fucking bastards. What can you do, dude? Get the fuck out of here. Get fucked. <sighs> Not budging at all. Oh, they must have barricaded me in here. A bunch of dicks. Alright. <laughs> Thanks for the map. Get out of here. The main entrance is too risky. Maybe that exit at the back of the station. There a way to pull the map up? They shut the fucking power off in here, too. Why did this door close again? It really doesn't matter. Oh shit! On my ass, dude! What the fuck? Oh! Pick up handcuff key? Oh, I see. Uh, 
All right, move the barricade out of the way. Yeah. Where do we move it to? Oh, convenient. Exit to new area. Yeah, I think we're good. We survived dead zone. If I'm going to get out of here, I'll need to go further into the police station to find another exit. Oh, so we're not even out yet. Shit, I thought that door was another exit. We have a long way to go. Okay, examine. Running. The best block in a fight is a city block. Run from danger and keep an eye on your cardio. Okay. I'm good at running. Video game. Not in real life. But I digress. Oh, shit. Oh, that camera looks like it still works. This isn't good. Nope. That's on. That's for a particular reason. Boiling steam is blocking the gates of some kind of crude security system. And it's working. Hmm. Looks oh, like it's something trying, baby. EOD fell. Hello. Welcome in, everybody. Welcome in. Last year played Final Fantasy IV? Damn. Nice. Sounds like you had some fun then. Welcome in, EOD. Uh, would love to know. Oh, Foxy's. Look at that. It's up on Foxy recommended. Thank you. Whistles innocently. <laughs> Foxy, thank you for that. I appreciate it. Dark Arcanine, welcome in. Yo, EOD, thank you so much for that follow. Welcome to the mob, dude. Holy crap, that clip is old. Yeah, this, these sometimes grab deep. <laughs> Every once in a while. <laughs> Dark Arcanine, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the mob. That's so good. Was it from like 2019? Holy shit. Yeah, a whole different like era. <laughs> All of mine tonight were from tonight's. That's crazy. Well, welcome in. Thank you so much. I appreciate you for uh, the raid. I appreciate Foxy for the recommendation. Uh, if you don't know who I am, I'm the Juggernaut. You can call me Juggernaut, Jug, Jugs, Juggy, Juggies, something along those lines. Uh, I'm a 99% horror streamer. Uh, the other 1% is just the random stuff like your clone heroes, your fall guys, and other stuff that kind of, you know, breaks up the 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 mess of horror sometimes. Uh, I'm part of the CEO of Screams uh, Twitch team, as well as the Channel 13 horror team uh, as well. If you haven't heard of them before and you, uh, you dig other horror streamers, uh, definitely check them out. Channel 13 also, that's their actual website. Um, we have our own YouTube page with a ton, a ton of content. If you like jump scare compilations, definitely check this out. All right, so I can't hear, but I got to go pick up the kiddos from Dance Gymnastics. Alert, come back if you're still alive. Have a great stream, mate. Oh. I will respond directly. Goddamn fucking ads as usual. Dugger was one who was kind enough to let me torture him tonight. Oh, nice. <laughs> Gotta love it. So, yeah, we're having a demo night tonight. Um, we played un the new Unfollow demo. Uh, we played the first one before, and they dropped a new one a few months back. I never got around to it, but here we are. Uh, and now we're on to Jarbreaker, which um, has a very... Uh, what's the term? Very post-apocalyptic, almost like survival game feel to it and there's like uh gangs involved and whatnot so so far so good I'm really enjoying it something goes there we don't know what yet oh, okay hello check this first it's locked. Of course it is. And I have to find the key somewhere. Somehow. Portable radar. That looks like a taser to me, and it says motion sensor at the top. Ooh. 
Oh. I'm like, oh, what? And there's something here. Oh. I like this thing. Tells you where all the good stuff is. Hello, can someone help me? Oh, hello? Oh, here's somewhere. Twelve gauge shells, rare. Take those. I'll take those. Where are the guns? The fuck? They're probably hard to come across. Anyone out there? I think my leg is broken. Oh, that's not good. Oh. Oh, there's the valve I need. But, uh, who are you? Hello? Oh, no. It was a trap. Corpse grinder shirt? Love it. Oh, this Fuck. Someone there? Are you hiding from me? Oh my god. I'm gonna rip your guts out. I need somewhere to fucking hide immediately, please. What I, what happened? Oh, I see what I, I did. Get the fuck out of here. Aha, fuck you assholes. Turn, turn, turn. Let's go. Let this shit off. Not enter until instructed by officer. Suck my ass. No turning back now. Suitcase. Store items in the suitcase to free up inventory space. Store items will move between levels with you. Ah, okay. Um, I'm gonna put the I'm gonna put the shells in there. I don't have a shotgun. I'll hold on to the painkillers and obviously this thing's really cool. Hello. What up, Nox? <laughs> the jump. This place isn't abandoned. I need to get out of here before those two animals track me down. Just woke up from a nap. Yeah, I sl I fucking took a nap too. Those masks I'm freaks fucked. The gang. This police station must be their hideout. Attention, everyone. We have an intruder. First one to bring me his peel on face gets oh. double rations this week. Oh no, this is like manhunt, but worse. Speak with Q and E, use your radar. You can throw objects to distract your foes. I didn't realize there's gonna be somebody right there. I didn't there, that's good to know. First. 
Oh! Oh, fuck, dude. How is this gonna... There was a light switch around the corner. <laughs> you died. <laughs> that is a funny died screen. All right. So there's more than two of them. We've uh, come to understand. I don't think I can skip this. Oh, press F to skip. There we go. Those masked freaks. Yeah. I guess I forgot about that, huh? I'm fucked. I won't go near that direction. Instead, I'll go around. I supposed to lose them. Oops. That wasn't what I thought it was. Bert, which way are you going? Stop being such a tease and come out. It's something. Why is I grab? What is? If you find him, save some for me. <sighs> Gonna go to bed. Good night, demon. Have a great night, my guy. Thanks so much for hanging with us. Ooh, bear trap. Seriously, dude. This is going to be rough. <laughs> I thought I had plenty of time to get over there. So I really need to find... So I have to find things that are throwable. I have to make a count. It's also the things made of glass. I don't know why it just immediately... Like, I just moved and it smashed up against the wall. It was pretty funny, actually. Oh, we should have to go through all these fucking cutscenes, though. That'd have been nice. I'm fucked. Well, I think green are the hiding spots. We got here. Uncle Faceless Token, it's currency, apparently. Note for the crew, the wiring is all screwed up on our new security door. If you need it open, you gotta pull the three override levers around the electrical grid in this area. Why would the electrical system work like that? It doesn't even make sense. Shut the fuck up is how it works. Hey, TJ. TJ is angry. There's three things we have to, three different things we have to switch.
I'm gonna wait for him to go all the way over. We just come all the way down here. That would blow ass. So audibly, he's not a very good listener. Eyes grab. Eyes Give put away. Save some for me. Seriously, put away was not the put away button. That was a I dropped it button. Son of a fuck, dude. Stop being such a tease and come out. Okay, bye. Dude! Let's have some fun. Oh. Oh. Ah. Yo, he caught up to me. <laughs> Oh, yikes. This game is, uh, gonna be real fucking difficult, apparently. I just don't, just, like, the second I pick up the glass, I have to do something with it, apparently. I can't, like, store it in my inventory and pull it out when I want to use it. It's just, uh, uh, here you go. There's a switch here. Okay. That vision ring. I don't even know what that is. But I'm safe over here because he won't come this way. So, what's this vision thing I picked up? A chemical cocktail that reveals all enemies for 60 seconds. Oh. That's interesting. We're trying to get to that door, apparently. Okay. Shit. Lights. Oh, okay. So this is what gets close. All right. So I have to open up the other two. One of them down in the next area.
That didn't really fucking work. Okay, so I need him to come back. I need to somehow slip past him. Oh, where, oh, where can he be? Finally, dude. I don't know why that was so difficult to get around. Oh, shit. Adrenaline, uncommon. Can't really increase running speed and give some of its stamina. Use cause use causes damage. Store one of those. <laughs> Maybe I shouldn't have done that. Got them. Oh, okay. Empty needle. Ah. Empty needle for. What do you have a different needle? I could crush up painkillers and inject for a stronger effect. Oh. Got it. Okay. I have to get over on to the left side here. Shit. an achievement freaky friends finally to unlock achievements there's one in every level okay huh don't I have the bathroom key Stop being such a tease and come out. do I have to go all the way around to get to the men's bathroom on the other side that is fucked Okay, so that's where I'm now the most amount of trouble. Make sure you stretch out those cream hamstrings. We'll do momentarily. I'm just very scared at the moment. Thank you, Cynthia. Let's hit a timeout right here. We'll do this nice stretch break. Oh, yeah. Oh. Oh, thank you. That actually felt fantastic. What's going to feel not fantastic is figuring out how to get the fuck around these idiots. That guy's just looking. Oh, he's looking at the TV. Oh, so he's uh, an interesting fella, then, I guess you could say.
all the way around. To, no, it cuts in the middle. Just want to bash your skull in. Shit. What the fuck? He what, he doubled back. Oh, that was fucking scary. Wait for him to go by. Now I'm gonna pull the switch. Should be all of them. If you find it, save some for me. You bro. Dare you? No, I'm good. Why do I, why would I need to do that? I got the door unlocked. Alright. We made it. We're good. Woo! That was a rough spot. I don't know why I could not get past that guy. Things have gone from bad to worse. This place is a hideout for the Faceless Gang. I need to be smart if I'm going to stay alive. GG. Thank you, Sue. Great. Jammed. Hmm. Unreal, man. Unreal. However, we have a candy ass on the premises. We were lost before the collapse. You. Check out the fucking poet over here. No way, let me laugh my ass off. Did we find this guy? First aid kit? Ah, there you are. You know, there are far more pleasant ways to die than stealing from the faceless gang. I wasn't. If you can see through that camera, why not just tell your crew where I am? Save time for the both of us. Why am I talking? As if you can hear me. The fun that? Let's see how far you get. I don't know what that was all about, but okay. Still jammed. This sucks. Radio. Yellow flare. Lucy. Can you Lucy, hear can you hear me? What the hell? Where have you been? You've been MIA for hours. I got set up. Seriously? We're gonna fix this. Get back here as soon as you can. Yeah, yeah. 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 Sure. You know we the coin. I want the coin. This, right? You gotta trust me. Yeah, it's fine. I gotta go. There's loot to be grabbed over there. Why am I getting the feeling I'm completely fucked? Uh, you are. It was supposed to be her turn to come here. You took over. No inventory space. Fudge. That opens. Okay. I'm not going that way yet. Fuck. Cool, so there's a password somewhere I can get. Oh. Oh, hi, baby. Oh, I would love to have that. 
big circle about this door. Damn, this is the door I came in through. Forward and find a way out. Yep, okay. Great. So there's no there's no luggage back here for me to use. I would really like to empty my inventory right about now. And only one other way I can go here. Fuck. Everyone in a horror game is pretty fucked, not gonna lie. Yeah. I wonder what's gonna happen here, everybody. It's almost like every single time I'm crawling through a space like this, I get jump scared. Firmly grasp it oh. slash SpongeBob, get out of my house. Not in your house. E card lock. I still can't fucking use this thing to tell where anything is. What a travesty. That noise. They're awake. I need to get back to the bunker before sundown. They're awake? What does that fucking mean? Oh, yes. Oh, it's the general store. Uncle Faceless General Store. Oh, they have an Atari here. That's really cool. Quiet. I could sit. Very nice. Oh, drink the coffee. Delicious. Then four. Always oh, get up. Okay. Well, that's cool. All right. Oh, we got a paint. We got painkillers. We got the syringe. Put the painkillers in. We've got the uh, vision mabobber, and we got a fucking silence pistol for. If oh, it's five tokens. I only have one. There's another one around the corner. Hey, look, a red fuse. Boston Betty's lighter. Oh. Okay. Let's um let's store the because I don't really know where they're supposed to be going. Killing stuff. Okay. Electronically locked, it'll open out. Alright, so yeah, this is... I'll leave the music on. So if I hear it, I know I'm close. Cool. Alright. I could light some of these candles to know where I've been. The candles are all fucking lit, my guy. Oh, these. Squeeze through. Fuck you. Fucking mannequins in every game, man. I can't use my flat uh, my fucking lighter. Free candy? Bro, really? Now I'm excited. Does this dude just not care about me? Guess not. You're just iffy. I was fucked. That scared the shit out of me. Oh, 
but I did that little tweet. Who fucking set up this room? Third. Okay. Cool. Glory. <laughs> oh, yeah, too scary. Yeah. <laughs> Whereas the lights came on, tree. <sighs> There's no getting through all that. Fire exists, no use. The main entrance is now the closest path to escape. At least we finally got there. Now we have to go out this way. Jesus. Now we have to go upstairs at this point. Oh. Else that way? Okay. Good, 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 good. Heckable timing. Oh, yeah. It's the tree beard way. It's locked with a padlock. Great. Do I have any documents? No document area here? Oh, wait. Inventory. I. Ba, ba, ba. Ba 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 bro and ba 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 bro and ba bro and take my hand ba bro and you got me rocking and a rolling rocking and a reeling ba bro and ba 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 bro and what the fuck is up Satan? I'll be doing well, my guy. I guess we have to go backwards. Ain't nothing around here that's helpful. Oh well, I don't leave. Yeah, I've been here. Barbaran. <laughs> oh, and I figured I'd see what was on Twitch. Well, you know, your, your, your good old pal Jugs on. Fucking shit in his pants. Fucking demos. Of games that are gonna probably be pretty goddamn good. Go back to the other dude who shit faced over here. Ba 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 I'm just passing through, brother. Not looking for trouble. Uh oh. I think I made a big mistake. Wait, oh, he gave me the that was the code. I'm just listen to it one more time. Off for today, friends, early mornings, trouble. have a great rest of the stream catch tomorrow. Soup, take it easy. Have a great night's sleep. Two. One. Two, one, three. Two, one, three, one. Two, one, three, one. Two, one, three, one. Two, one, one. Two, one, three, one. Two, one, three. Two, one, three. Two, one, three, one. Two, one, three, one. Two, three, one. Two, one, two, one, three, one. Two, one, three, one. You. Hello? Oh. Just spins one way, I guess. Yeah! 
zero four five one. How dare you? Let's go. Attention, everyone. One hour to sundown. If that intruder isn't chopped up immediately, I'll lock the bunker and let them kill you all. Open the safe. Okay. Oh, the key card. Oh, shit. I have to go backwards. I never got the other, uh... Never got the other tokens. The other token that was back there. Oop. I can do it really quick. Ah! Oh god! Oh my god, you can't go back at that part! Oh! Oh, oh, oh. Damn freaks. <sighs> Holy fuck, dude. Drunk piece of shit. Free candy. Oh. That was something. I was like, I'm just gonna run back so I can grab everything and like, empty up my inventory again. And that little bastard was like, well, I gave him the answer, so now I get to jump scare him. That's the rules. <clears throat> now I'll probably get jump scared going this way instead. I'm not clipping that. No fucking chance I'm going to clip that. Sounds like that guy that chased me through the offices. I need to hurry up and get out of here. Oh, for fuck's sakes. Into my ass. All I wanted was that fucking token. No, we still haven't got that yet. Need the, the uh, key card. Where was the key card reader? I think it was in here. There may be, but I think over here we need to go. Yes. Okay. We're going to store these. I, th I think I have three of them. Yep. Three of them. So that could get me that whole thing or just the vision, which I haven't used vision. I put it in my bag and left. Let's see. Yep, right here. Right in here. What's so important in here? Examine. <clears throat> Read. Who's a jackass that locked the armory? TJ. Be <laughs> Me, homie, keeps the riffraff out. Brittle Jones. What's the password? I need some shit in there, TJ. It's right before your eyes, if you know what I mean, Brittle Jones. I don't, TJ. Right before your eyes. Or your eye. Has to be somewhere in here, right? That's what that's saying. Those are four people clipped it. I did too. <laughs> This puzzle is a little difficult. Not too sure I understand fully. Oh. I don't know the number down. I would assume that's a 16. Over here.
Oh, I see. So this one is, uh, wait, that's where the girl stood up and they chased me. Staircase were up. Uh -huh. That's a fucking seven. I'm not entirely sure where that one is, but those four locations will have numbers for sure. I don't know how the fuck I'm able to get back there. Unless I'm overthinking and that's actually an easy spot to get. One has an eye in it. One of the monitors has an eye in it. I think the paper mentions an eye right in front of your eyes. Yeah. So it's the eyes here and it's right in front of it. It's probably like on this wall. There's no eye in that one. That's a seven. I don't see an eye in that one. Hmm. There's a very good point though. Five. Oh, there's no, this isn't the camera spot though. That's just that's just telling us this is probably like cell block five or whatever. Yeah, because this is a camera looking right at that five. So I would see that, so it's not one of the ones that I should turn on. All right, let me go back a ways. And um, I'll see if there's a way to get it to. Yeah, that's looking right at a nine, so it's not that one. This one's looking at me. Fuck you. Here's, the, here's an eye, but what's in front of it? Anything but a number. Not here. Oh, right here. This is the room. Okay, so it's got to be on that wall. Fuck, I can't even see. Unless it's supposed to be a three, because it's right there. Yeah, it's... That dude's dead. Ugh. Damn, dude. How am I supposed to... my eyes it's on the other side of this wall right it technically is that could be a three and what is this I don't fucking tell there is there a number in that room at all There's two eyes, technically. Anybody have any ideas on this one? That is, like, this is definitely the first monitor. There's a camera up, like, on the opposite side of the wall right here, looking in that direction, where you can only see this one eye. You can't see the other one. I'm bad. I'm the motherfucker on the world. Sugar! Thank you for the subscription. Seven months. Getting real close to that sub, baby. Better come up with a good name. <laughs> Fucking emote kills me. I don't know. Where was the next... Let's find where the next location was. That might be helpful. Next one, that's to get... Oh, uh, by the up, going up the stairs. This is apparently a seven. This one is... I don't think we've... I'll keep my eyes open for it. All right, let's head towards the stairs.
What a fucking mess this place is. Just throwing shit everywhere. It be it isn't the place that uh worried about. I do have to fucking run. Okay. Yep, there's the camera. It's looking here. Yeah, there's a seven. That's from this angle here. Yeah. Okay, this is that question. So what's the point of this one? This one's looking here. No number behind it. Unless it's this number here. That's what it's got to be, I guess. Testing to see how this looks in stream. Don't mind me. Go about your business as usual. Is it a 7 or a Z with no bottom? It's definitely a 7. Because this is supposed to give us um, a key code. So I think that's a seven. I mean, we know that's a seven, so that's the third one. The fourth one, I don't know where that is. The second one, I guess is a zero. Brain has mush. Okay, so have. Head to bed, go escaping. Fry, thank you so much. Hope you have a lovely night's sleep. And uh, I'm sure I'll talk to you soon. Okay, so. This one we don't know. This one is zero. This is a seven. This one we don't know. Zero and seven are in the middle. I'm gonna have to go with uh, whatever, I think it was a three. Let me go double check. It's right in front of the eyes. Up two feet. Moment. Nice. This one is looking here, but what's not really in front of it, but there's a three. Oh. Yeah, it is a three. Okay. I don't know what the fuck the other number is supposed to be. So, 307 something. hope one of these works. Getting really worried. Fuck me. Shit. Alright, so I fucked something up. I'm not getting this puzzle. Like, I don't have to worry about the last place. The last place we could do the guessing game with. But this is so confusing to me. Like. Oh my. Okay. That's how that works. It has a two on it. We're gonna pass that five a ton. Yeah, it's. I didn't realize like change the channel will actually give me something to look at in terms of numbers. Okay, five three seven zero. Not even close to what I was. Playing. Fuck. 
Hope Tree didn't see that. 5370. 5270. Dude, what the fuck? 0451 Yes. I am now very confused. Because this one only be a five. This one could be a two, more likely a three. This I can't change, it's only a seven. That only has a zero. Might be one, three, five, seven. Why would it be one, three, five, seven? I'll be honest, I haven't been paying much attention. Is it a four digit or a five digit? I mean, there's only four. Oh, no. Didn't see this one over here. Guys, I'm fucking up today. Nine. Okay. Let's do five, three, seven, oh, nine. Five, three, seven, oh, nine. Thank you, Dark Archon. You actually helped. You helped big time. 53709. Let's go. Finally. Made it to the armory. Weapons. Get wrecked, idiot. Weapons are rare and loud, but can save your life if hiding, running, or sneaking fail. Yeah, I actually don't have my, uh... Oh. So that's where that fuse goes. Sawn off shotgun. Hmm. It'll wake the whole building up, but... Could save my life if I get cornered. I don't have the, uh... The shells with me. They're, they're back in the suitcase. So... Which fuse has to go here? I was holding one? That was loud as fuck. I didn't realize I had one on me. Heck yes, I helped. Hmm. Could give this new shotgun a little test. From in here? That scared the fucking life out of me. Back here. Uh, how did I have another fuse? Exit has been opened. That's good. I don't really care to try out the shotgun. I am going to fucking reload, though. You never know. All loaded up and good to go. Okay. Fingers crossed it's just a killer chihuahua this time. Can't be in these streets wasting ammo. Hell no. Oh my fuck! There you are. Shoot him! You Shoot him! Away, Shoot him! You? Shoot him, you fucker! <laughs> Shoot this piece of fucking trash. I'm gonna take all my I just got the motherfucking shotgun. So welcome to the world of Jawbreaker. Unique enemies, items, locations, boss fights, much more winning the full game as you sneak or fight your way through a collapsed society. Go! Game by Vincent Ladd. Played. 
boom, boom. That was that was a fucking banger of a track. Um, yeah, okay. Uh, so that game's gonna be fucking awesome. Press escape, X to main menu. Yeah, this game's gonna fucking wreck. Trust me. It's it was a little difficult to understand everything, but once I got going, I was good. That's that's fun fucking shit right there. I already got a clip out of the demo. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Okay, so the last one we have on here is Tic Tac 12 o'clock. We get that up and running. Tic Tac 12. Time for bed now, hugs to all. Had a good stream and hope everyone has a good evening. Thank you, Dark Arcanine. Appreciate you. Thanks again for dropping in and hitting up with, with a follow. Hope to catch you again soon. Uh, we'll be back tomorrow playing Hollow Cocoon if you're interested. And then, uh, oh, and Resident Evil 4, I think we're wrapping up the next day. Switch my game capture over. Damn. I can already hear the music and it's fucking loud. Joe ads. Sugar. That was very kind of you. Thanks for the gift sub to Satan. I'm sure he appreciates that. looking at all the different shit here lost e for interact shift to run control to crouch f for flashlight r to reload the flashlight i for inventory j for journal good enough yeah i'd free my bb <laughs> sick all right i think we're good to go Tic Tac 12 o'clock. Uh, oh, I didn't read the uh, the Steam page for this one. I'm sorry. Hold on. Tic Tac 12 o'clock. Tic Tac 12 o'clock is a single adventure puzzle game with a storyline that runs through survival horror in the Blue Bird Middle School. You must spend several nights in an abandoned building trying to find out what's going on and protect your life. Hmm. Okay, then. Nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, and then Saturday's locked out, I guess. I don't understand. The student missed, but police have closed the school. Well, they announced that it would be closing. ASDS. The investigation. <laughs> don't you understand? If clerk misses, will the police close the bank? I think we need to seek him in the place where he could go, but not in the place where he studied. And if he really disappeared at the school? I'm sure he is. Why does Will look at the dude what from Stranger so? Things? <laughs> the fact is that something similar Will looks has like Will. happened. Look, I found this clipping in the city archives. It's about a mysterious incident in our school. Oh, just don't start with all this nonsense about the Indian Cemetery, secret military base in the mountains, or a live car. What's in there, Will? Wow, it's about the murder in our school. Where did you get this? My father. He works in the archive. Sometimes my mother takes me there after school when she hurries somewhere. There's a lot of old binders, but the oldest newspapers are in the basement. I can't go there in daytime. It's so creepy. Just look at this photo. I always knew there was something wrong with this hole. In the 70s, the so building housed a high school. Obvious content warning it was closed here, I guess. after the murdered student Jeez. Jennifer Fox from a support group was found in the woman's restroom. She was missing two weeks earlier. 
They tried to hush up a loud scandal about murder and rape. But an amateur video made by unknown persons got into the press. It was about bullying a girl. What's the connection between this unfortunate girl and the missing student? This girl, Jennifer, she disappeared and nobody could find her for two weeks. They were looking for her everywhere, but they found her at the school. I'm sure we can find our missing friend alive if we hurry. We have exactly one week left. We? To find? Why not just tell the police? Who will believe us? First, I suggest you explore the school yourself. By ourself? How? The school is closed by the police. We don't have to go to school. You can get to the guard post and use the video control system to observe every corner at least all night. Didn't the police shut down the school? And even if we turn on the lights, the building will shine with windows like a Christmas tree, and any bystander will call the cops. You know, my old man in the army was a tough specialist in technology, so he helped the contractor equip our school with cameras. The guard post has its own independent generator in the garage. Of course. It is just enough for dim emergency lighting and cameras, and getting to the post through the garage is a trifling matter. So let's do it. We take the walkie-talkie and split up. Will will steal the keys to the city archives from his father tonight and go look for any mention of our school in the vault in the basement. Good. I will try to learn about other creepy stories of our school. Corey will sit in the driveway to the school on the watch sentinel. Right, big leader. I'll infiltrate the security post and watch the school through security cameras. Jerry, you stay at the base. Coordinate our actions and supply information. Okay, I just have a couple of books about cameras and security. There was something about diesel generators in the big encyclopedia, and the computer will be at hand. Can we do it? Definitely. We'll find out what the hell is going on in this school. Or just waste a lot of time. Yeah. Don't whine. If there's a chance, we should try. I think. Okay. I like that intro. Different type of comic book vibe. Jerry, I'm here. Okay. Look around for now. Keep in touch. Welcome. Okay. back here and if oh can't go that way oh Fahrenheit 451 what a great book must uh must read if you haven't oh my god the old fucking energy fucking load up old bios and shit oh my god of importance in there okay i mean i wouldn't totally anticipate there to be something immediately in the first run of course the radio fucking works security support there's a phone number interesting Eating rats stinks like something died probably Friendship, yeah. Wanted. Original drawing. Ended drawing. Commenting our bulletin, 8769 of October 1969. Additional information is about the above drawing of murder suspect known as Zoe. 
fuck. The Zodiac Killer. White male, 35 to 45 years, approximately 5'8", heavy build, short brown hair, possibly with red tint, wears glasses, armed with 9mm automatic. Ted Cruz? Ha <laughs> ha! There it is. I don't have that yet. Can't open that. Gotta find a... Uh... Oh, Jesus. Taped electronics inspection. Bluebird School, May 6, 1984, 1045 AM. Din Smith. Blades about surveillance cameras. Auto stable operation of the generator. Report during the investigation, physical damage to the cameras was revealed. A large amount of barbed wire was revealed in the generator, which led to short circuits and an unstable power supply. What the fuck? Looks like it's running now. Really? Ah. How are you? Did you check the video control system? Not yet, dickhead. Not everything is smart at once. Now let's see what do we have there. I don't even know where the hell the system is. I mean, this is clearly something I need to have. Um, all right, everything's on. Going on out there. No, you can't use any of that. Can't open that door or that one. Bunch of post it notes here. I wish I could fucking zoom. I can't see what that is. Looks like 858 for a second. Godfather. No. This is here, so I guess we'll leave that off. Yo, Gothy, what's up, my friend? Hope you're doing well. I don't know what this is supposed to be doing here. I repeat, it is a generalization. It is a play. I can't understand a word that dude's fucking saying. That has a number. Like, that one right there has like a number written down and circled. And I can't fucking zoom for whatever reason. Check the surveillance cameras. Brother, how? Oh. I 
Aha. Um. Here we go. Admin seventeen three nine nine seven four six. Real good job on that shit, guys. Some cameras don't have a signal, and so there is order. Perhaps the power of the generator that Coy was talking about is not enough. Yeah. This is not accurate. Take a better look at it so there is no trouble with electricity. Uh, this game is called, um, I looked over and it's not the right thing in OBS. I mean, I updated in OBS, but now it's not there. Essentially, we are trying to solve the mystery that happened at this at our school and we broke in and then uh trying to my character's handling the surveillance here a1 e2 So it's this, yeah, so in here it should matter. I don't think we need the elevator on. At least not yet. Uh, hello? Why can't I go back and look at the cameras again? The fuck happened? This is not right. What is this? Eight. Maybe we can only do one at a time. I still can't look. Fuck. Bizarre. I don't know why I can't look at the cameras again. I'm good. Chilling up some pizza? Hell yeah. Love that fucking pizza. Oh, so we can find a random uh, three digit code anywhere? Oh, okay. I don't know why I can't fucking sit down and look at the cameras again. What does it want me to do? Inspect the generator in the garage. Okay, glad I hit that button. Drugs for using the DG9000. Get to the generator power supply. Do a surveillance system, the metal roller shutters, internal light sources, or external lighting, elevator in the tech technical corridor. Metal roller shutters, reduce surveillance system, and technical elevator have a high level of charge consumption. Temperature sensor. The arrow of the sensor indicates the temperature level of the generator. The maximum indicator of the arrow, it may overheat, which will entail, which will entail an unstable operation of the power supply. Okay. We're not going to turn the shutters on. If you're just we need elevator, you don't necessarily need it at the moment. Apparently, it's a generator charge indicator. I wonder how you can charge it. Ah. 
Looks like it needs some kind of tool. Okay. So, what kind of tool is that? Motherfucker, I inspected it already. And I bet you it's in here. I don't know what the fucking combination is to that. It has to be something that's three. You already have some kind of tool right here. Her, 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 got him. Fucking Jesus. Oh, Satan, my Satan. What would it be? I haven't found anything that really dictates. Oh wait, there's something in here that I haven't found. Oh no, there was that. Okay, but there's no three digits in here anywhere from what I can see. Wait. Oh. Easier than I thought. Sure? Oh yeah, you're sure. Okay, cool. Uh... That looking... Still fine, okay. How are you? Did you check the video control system? Go back and check it now. Tree. Fuck six. Three nine nine seven four six. Seven four six. Save my login. Those cameras still don't fucking work. No, I've enabled them. Or I thought I did. the fuck that's not fucking good that's in the restrooms cam Open that, okay. Poe. No numbers anywhere if I can tell. I was hoping it would be in the fucking crash. That'd be really fucking funny if it was. Okay. Need to monitor the surveillance cameras. Okay. And do.
Oh, Fuck it. Just... It moves. You're next. I think we'd be here next. The directions traveling in. Oh, now well, we can kind of see. None of these work. Click through them. See, I click through them. Go. What the hell is this? Looks like a cheerleader, my friend. Did it disappear or, or what? Not oh, there we go. Touch all the other ones. Something smells like teen spirit. Ooh, lovely. Backwards, right? There we go. <clears throat> Fuck. Fuck. All right. It's slowly making its way over to where I think where I am. Thing is almost under the door, Jerry. Here's the front door with a button. They're lowering the metal roller shutter. Urgently close it. Faster. I'm sorry. What did you just fucking say? That thing's open. There's a little roller shutter at the front door. It's already fucking closed. I do that. That's not it.
I don't know how to fucking clo It's at the front door. I don't know where the front door is. Well, hold on, hold on. I can figure it out. Figure it out. Service corridor. There's a, there's security. Oh, it's right outside my security. Okay. What's well, considered the front door? The garage? Or the hallway? About hallway here. This right here. I don't know how I could possibly lower something. Unless it's this fucking thing right here. That works or not? There's another one shot at the front door. I don't know how to fucking do that. None of these doors fucking open. Like, am I going insane here? I'm I'm not entirely sure how to close this is the hallway right here I'm assuming that's the front door but it's hard to tell the service hallway I have no idea how to do what it's telling me to do Close the metal roller shutter at the front door. Why did this turn off? are on. Okay. Still on. Okay. Still no options of doing anything. I'm so fucking What is this? 
it keeps undoing itself. Same? Okay, hey, good. And I am so fucking lost. Are these gonna magically work now? No, I didn't think so. Like, there's no button anywhere I can press, like, lower the gate that I'm looking at or something. Jesus, it's 5.20 in the morning in, in game time. I think I'm going to run out of fucking time. Like, it's, it's, so now why did A2 turn? It's something to do with the reds, I think. Maybe that's what it is. Now why is that in red? Wow, that's quite interesting. Like, is... I'm not even sure that's what I'm supposed to be doing. Oh, this is fucking bizarre. Turn it all on. Fuck it. What's gonna happen? Nothing. Nothing there. There. This is insane. I feel like I'm missing something super easy. Like, would I have to go and press a button to do that? Metal sh- Wait a minute, is it this? Yeah, it is this. How do I close those? Oh my god. Okay. I did it. Fuck's sake. All the things are on, too. I'm a dummy. Satan, don't even. <laughs> Yeah, you close the door. Oh God! Holy fuck! Oh shit! Thank you for playing our demo. Add us to wish list and keep watching for updates. The full version will coming soon. Fuck, man. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Applause. Yeah, this one is going to be interesting. I just, I wish I didn't have all that trouble there trying to get, I didn't realize like, oh, that, that's the front door, apparently, into a hallway. But, uh, no, definitely good concept here. Um, it reminds, like, there's a little bit of the Aptos Covert feel to it. We played that recently. Um, 
some influence from like your Five Nights at Freddy's type of games too, it looks like. Power conservation, I'm sure. Different closing of doors. So, yeah, it looks like it should be pretty good. And actually, that, uh... That's actually doing pretty good for us at this point. What's the collection? All right, hold up, hold up, hold up. Listen, come back here. What is this? Oh, you get a card for each of the um, nights you stay. And that's, yes, yeah, so this is the cheerleader that was murdered. These have coins on them that you, so you can't touch them yet. Oh, and this is the different cutscenes, I guess. That's pretty cool. Nice little Ouija board and bobber. Bluebird bastards. Well, cool. I like the little collection thing there. All right. Sorry. Just wanted to show you all that really quick before I close out of it. Um, so, I don't really have time to kick off another one but we have um the other demos that i have here for sure we'll have to be we'll play soon is the mute house demo which i saw a um a trailer for that on the horror game awards last month it looked pretty good and then um ebola village i have a demo for that as well dami mommy kaylee what's up welcome in my friend hope you've been well we just played a couple of, de well, three demos, and all three of them definitely, uh, definitely felt good. A little things here and there, I'm kind of like, hmm. But uh, all three of those games definitely had a good feel. Uh, and excited to be playing all three of them probably later this year. Uh, Jawbreaker comes out in March, but um, what did Tic Tac 12 say? Tic Tac 12 o'clock just says coming soon, and unfollow. I believe just said 2024. Yeah, release 2024. So we don't know for sure yet when those are coming out. But yeah, that, uh, the new unfollow demo actually came out on Halloween. Uh, I can't believe it took me that long to get around to it. But uh, I'm glad I did. That game's gonna be fucking crazy. Uh, so, as I mentioned, we're, uh, your project's on board. I do. I haven't played in a while. Um,. But it's it's a good game. It really is. Mm -hmm. Let's see. Who should we raid today? We have Heavy's playing Pal World. Wheeler Dealers playing Half Life Two. Uh. We got Uncle Dozer playing Wavetail. We got Ginger playing The Hope Bringer. Sass is playing Lethal Company. Zonum's up doing some art. Menace of Tacos playing Alan Wake 2. Grumpy Boy's playing Alan Wake 2. Llama Goddess is playing Dead Signal. Ouija Boo's playing Legend of Zelda A Link to the Past. I have a server up for it. Oh, that's pretty cool. You know, we haven't, um,. I think. I don't think we've raided Sass in a while. And she, I'm pretty sure she's been raiding us quite a bit. And it's Lethal Company. Everyone loves Lethal Company. This shit's fucking hilarious. So it looks like she's playing. Um, who's she playing with here? I can't tell. The names aren't popping up. I don't know. She's definitely playing with a few people. Well, she's currently dead in the game. <laughs> Um, but yeah, thank you all so much for hanging out. I really enjoy playing these, um, these demo games and, uh, well, demos of games that we know, like, okay, like, what do we have to look forward to? So now when, like, when Unfollow drops eventually this year, like, we're all going to freak out and go fucking play it. We're welcome to join anytime if you want to. Well, thank you. Yeah, I haven't played the game in a couple of years, but if I ever find my way back to it, I'll definitely keep you in mind. Appreciate you. Um, 
So, what was I going to say? Ah, yes. So thank you all for hanging out tonight. I really appreciate you all chilling. And um, I know we don't get to do a lot of demo nights, so it is definitely uh, something different for us. But I appreciate you all the same for coming to hang out and check these games out. Um, if you liked any of the games and you're interested in playing them, definitely go to their Steam pages, add this, um, the game to your wish list. Um, I know a lot of people don't really like pay attention to add to wish list. They're just like, oh, I'll just follow it or something. But adding to wish list will keep you up to speed with release dates, updates, um, discounts when it, it's finally available, like if there's a sale, and uh, that most importantly, when you add a game to your wish list, it's actually like it's keeping track of that and the analytics for that developer. And the more times that your game is wish listed, the more likely that Steam is going to help them out with some different um, like assistance programs, I guess. Um, I just learned about this recently, just hearing from another developer. So I try to make sure that um, I make reference to that. Like, if you like a game, and not even just the demos today, but any game that you see that uh, I'm playing on here or any other horror streamer or any other streamer for that matter, you like if you think the game looks cool, you'd like to play it, add it to your wish list, you know? Um, definitely worth. But uh, that's going to do it for us tonight. So I am going to uh kick off our raid messages and some links here about the socials first and foremost get on your clipboard ready to go whether it's the first line there for subscribers or the second line with the red pickaxe for everybody else or use whatever emotes you want that's totally fine uh when we get over to sass's uh stream make sure you just fucking bombard with those messages uh so thank you all again uh we had a bunch of uh, new followers today. We had a bunch of new uh, subs, gifted subs as well. Again, thank you all so much for being so supportive. Uh, if you want to be further supportive and nothing to do with like money, monetary considerations, anything like that, um, you, can you can follow me or subscribe to me or whatever the term happens to be for that platform. Uh, I'm on YouTube. We post a... Um, you post VODs Monday, Wednesday, Friday, uh, usually in the morning EST time around 9 a.m. And on Tuesdays and Thursdays, I will drop a YouTube short from one of our recent clips that's really either really funny or it's a really good jump scare. And uh, those posts, uh, of late, I've been having some good luck in the afternoon. I used to kick right around 11.30 to 12.45-ish, but 2.30 the past, the past week or so has been pretty good. You'll drop your shorts. I mean, that's some, well... That's a lot of subs, Satan. <laughs> um, if you prefer watching your short form content over on TikTok, I'm also on TikTok. I post the same the same schedule over there as I would with YouTube Shorts until I find a better like something that works better for either platform. So right now the shorts will post on both at around two thirty in the afternoon Eastern Standard Time, Tuesdays and Thursdays. Uh, follow me on Twitter. Obvious stuff there. If you want to call it X, you can call it X. It's fine. Uh, and then if you are, you're in a bunch of discords, but you feel like you still want to get that one more discord in there, come join us. It's our place. It's the place for the jug mob to hang out. It's our home away from home when we're not streaming. Uh, we watch, we'll watch different, uh, movies there, wrestling events, question the day bots. Usually got some good conversations, meme trading. I mean, all sorts of goody goodies. You too, Twy. Appreciate you. Thanks for dropping in and hanging out with us tonight. Uh, but yeah, that's pretty much all I've got. So let's go ahead and kick off the raid to our dear friend, Sassafras. Sassafras underscore one, four, three specifically, but well, you can go by, uh, call her Sass for short. So, uh, she is playing lethal company. She is a fellow CEO of screams member with me, uh, and many others. Uh, she's also part of the group known as ghoul friends with herself, her sister, Air Cygnus, um, uh, Crims, who is, uh, she's been having a fun birthday uh, subathon. And then I know Remy Necro pops in from time to time as well. Gothy, good to see you in here as well. Thank you for dropping by. So yeah, let's all uh, jump on this raid together. Let's go show some love to Sass. If you dig the content, please consider dropping a follow. Uh, it's, it's super helpful to all of us to understand like how many people are interested and 
would be interested, you know, to come back and hang out with us again. Uh, Cause that's what it's all about is getting people together, having a few laughs, some jump scares, you know, all the good stuff. Um, as for me, I'm going to go chill. I'm going to be up early tomorrow, uh, but I'll be back tomorrow night. We are going to be playing uh, the start of Hollow Cocoon. I've heard some good things about it, so don't miss out. I'll be back tomorrow, 10 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Till then, have fun with Sass and be good to yourselves. Bye.